A local group is working to enlist an army of people to honor the families of our nation's fallen heroes. 13 on your side's Matt Gard shows us what help they need in today's One Good Thing. The quiet town of Trufant, Michigan is at the center of a major nationwide effort and it all starts in one man's workshop. It's something my dad taught me to do. Doug Pickle works with wood as a hobby. The woods come to life and they tell the story. But the plaques he makes are good enough that some hang in museums. There's 50 hours total into each one. He makes them specifically for family members of fallen heroes. We're gonna remember their name. We're gonna say their name every day. In 2011, that list of names grew. And this weekend, we lost 30 of them when their helicopter crashed during a mission in Afghanistan. A Taliban rocket hit that helicopter, killing those 30 American servicemen, one U.S. Navy canine, and seven members of the Afghan National Army. There's a guy from Michigan on it. Honoring those service members is Doug's latest project. My purpose comes through. And I see that hope that the family gets. Doug isn't the only one with purpose. It's a neat way to preserve a picture that can last a long time. When he's done carving, his neighbor, Jeannie Thornhill, uses this machine to etch the names and images of our nation's heroes. It's emotional for me. My granddad put in 36 years in the Army. His image is immortalized in her workshop. It it means a lot to honor these guys. A single plaque costs $300 to make, so Doug's upping the ante on fundraising. Come out and pick on me, let's have fun. He's growing his hair and beard out, and whoever makes the biggest donation will get to decide what color he dyes it. I have to wear those colors October 8th to the two Myers that I work in Rockford and Cedar Springs. It's all worth it to Doug to remember the fallen. It's always been said that you die twice. The first time when you pass away and then the second time is the last time somebody says your name. Not on my watch. If you would like to help out, we have a link to the fundraiser at 13onyourside.com. And if you have something positive going on in your community, email your story ideas to one good thing at 13onyourside.com. Reporting in Montcalm County, I'm Matt Gard for 13 on your side.